So when light is redshifted, it is moving away from us. Things that are moving away from us stretch out. So we can see the wavelength is increasing. When things are blue shifted, the light is being squashed, it is moving towards us, and the wavelength is getting smaller. So with redshift, the waves are going to be stretched out. So you're going to see an increased wavelength, a decreased frequency. It's called redshift because the light is shifting to the red end of the spectrum, and that is moving away from us. If a star is blue shifted, it is moving closer to us. The light is going to be shifted towards the blue end of the spectrum. You're going to see a decreased wavelength and an increased frequency. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I really hope you found this video helpful. If you want to say thank you or if you want access to my online classroom priority video requests or to see all the books I'm publishing, you can pop over to Conos or keep up to date with everything on my website. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. And if you follow me on Twitter or like me on Facebook, you'll get all the updates there. Thanks for watching, guys. I really hope you found this helpful. Anything else you need, any other help you need, just let me know below.